Former leaders bring a wealth of experience and wisdom gained during their time in office. Regular interactions with them provide an opportunity to tap into their knowledge, insights and lessons learned from navigating complex political, economic and social challenges. It is for this reason that President Hagen de Hitchlema hosted former vice presidents and their spouses at State House for a lunch on to appreciate their services while in office. So you are vice president, so continue performing those roles and uh, keep our country together. I deliberately say so. Zambia is a unitary state and we would like you leaders to continue preaching that aspect of this country remaining a unitary state. As you taught us, you were taught by KK and our forefathers, independence fathers, it's one Zambia, one nation, one nation, one people. Former Vice President Brigadier General Godfrey Mianda spoke on behalf of other former Vice Presidents. On behalf of my wife, and our family, we thank His Excellency, the President of Zambia, for recognizing us. How did he recognize? If somebody says, can you go and do this for me? The attitudes may be two. One is that, look, this chap, look at him again. He's doing this to me. But I learned to say, if a person comes to you and say, can you do this for me? They are recognizing that you have a quality, although they are not saying so. You have a quality, and they want you to assist them. So all of us Zambians, when the government requires us to assist it in one way or another, don't take it that the government is foolish. They are now desperate. They are stranded. They are come to us. No. Those who attended the lunch on included Dr. Neva Sumumba, Mr. Ino Kavindele, and Brigadier General Godfrey Mianda, while former Prime Minister Malimba Masheke and former Vice Presidents Inonga Wina and Dr. Guy Scott could not be available as they were reported EU. However, by broadcast time, President Hitchlema was on his way to former Vice President Dr. Guy Scott's house to check on him, while another government delegation was dispatched to both Madame Inonga Wina and General Malimba Masheke's residences to check on them respectively. Kalan Muchima, reporting for Zanis.